Hey everybody, this is Sheets, and we're going to be doing the line of construction video for this 2 a.m. slate. Um, just catching me before I am crashing, so I'm able to actually see some substitutions for the first match. So we're going to incorporate those into our build, and um, we'll see what we come up with. We already uh, uploaded projections, and we ran a 1,000 lineups. And again, the big news is that Kellen remains out for uh, Don Juan Kia. Uh, and also uh, for non-shim, we have um, in the support um, Vital instead of Bouguer. Um, so and we just got that news recently. So it's possible that not everybody has the news. So all else being equal, we probably want to go overweight on those two uh, players um, where it, where appropriate. Okay, that doesn't mean we're going to want to lock in someone from non-shim, but um, I would say that if we are playing non-shim stacks, we probably want to use um, Vital in them because he'll probably be the lowest owned of all five of them, all the players, because nobody, you know, not everybody was sure he was playing. And likewise, if we are playing DK, um, we we do want to play Moham in the support. I just think he's going to be a little bit lower owned than he could be if everybody knew that he was playing. Uh, not to mention that he is probably more expensive than Kellen anyway. So uh, these are the probably the two key players that I would hope to get if we did get some Nanshim or um, and or DK stacks him. Certainly, we're going to get one of these two because they're playing each other. Um, so as far as the as far as the slate goes, um, well, hold on. Do we have all of the the the, the Fredrik Brion news? See, this is the problem. Also, we're not exactly sure who's playing here either. Um, but we're gonna go with who are we gonna go with? I mean, Envy, Morgan, Yunjai, Fate. Palu in the in, in the support, but again, I mean, it's not as if we need to play that much much of them anyway. Again, we have we have two big favorites here. You have you have Don Juan Kia as an eight to one favorite, and uh, T one is as about a, you know a ten to one favorite. But again, the chances that both of them win, they're not that much. You know, you have let's say they're you know even point. 0.9 each that means 20 20 percent of the time one of them's losing you know so um and stacks without the two of them together without dk and t1 together are going to be probably very very low on so you probably do want to make rules that you don't want to play and i know this is annoying but you don't want to play you know just straight four or three stacks in, in the shock blast with both Don Juan Kia and C1. So we're probably going to force our way in to, you know, to, to make sure that doesn't happen. So we built our lineups and, and as you probably would, would, would imagine, you, know, you get hundred percent T1 DK, but as we've discussed, you can't play these lineups. You just can't, they're, they're going to be mega, mega duped. Um, all of them. So, we have to do something else. The only thing we can do, we could do four twos or or even three threes or just either play some non-shim or, or Fred Prion. Now, first thing I will say is that of these 40 lineups, at least before we run the Sims, five of them are four twos. So those are the ones we're definitely going to use those. We're not going to any three threes though. All right, so let's... Uh, Let's um let's run a sim here and see what we get. And again, we're just gonna run these against ourselves. You know, we we built our thousand our you know our, our five thousand lineups and um we're just gonna run it against ourselves. We're not gonna trust the saber sim ownership necessarily. We'll just run it against our own build. And okay, so and build two, 
no, we're this is going to be the triumphant warrior. Sorry, custom, and then only like twenty people in it. So save that, and then the shock blast. I presume we're using. Well, let's use build two for that, and we'll run the Sims and see what we get. And again, what we're going to do is we're not going to play any uh, DKT one together, uh, unless it's like a four two or something like that. And I would like to play as much as I could of of those those uh, of Moham, and if we get Nonsham, the uh, valid or vital. So we're still not getting to anything here. Um, that's not T1 DK together, even when we run the Sims here. Now let's see. We go Min Uniques two slash Min Uniques three. Now we're kind of getting there. But again, this is this is nice and all that, but but you don't really. I mean, you still end up playing like these incredibly chalky lineups. So, what we're gonna have to do is is do some geomean filtering and and that in that way, make sure that we don't get any T one DK together, um, unless they're four twos. So let's. Uh, well, first, let's take a look at what we have here. So of, of all these lineups, when we run the Sims, we go min uniques three, you are getting about 18 four twos. So I definitely want to play them. Now let's just see what that looks like when we go to min uniques two. Um, not even more. I mean, you get, let's see min uniques one. So if you go just to min uniques one, you do get 15 of the 40 and four twos. And I think we'll go with that, you know, and, and, and so if we play four twos, let's see what these, those are going to look like, by the way, we put non shim in the, well, so these are, some of these are pretty interesting. You get some Mahili in the, as a one-off you have, well, you obviously get some with the team of the one-off, some Fisher, some one-offs. Okay. So this is actually pretty good. Um, we, and we don't need to do, you know, what's his name? Vital as a support one-off. Uh, if we get to him, great, but we don't need to. So I, I want to keep these four twos. So let's um, save these just to a CSV file. And then we're going to play nothing but four threes. And make sure that we get just anything but TK and D1 and DK T1 together. So let's first go to team stacks, uh, sorry, stack exposure, 100% four threes for, for the purpose of this. Because I already have the four twos that I want. Um, So let's build, I mean, let's do a geo mean filter. That's the best way to do this. So let's, instead of just making a flat rule. So we're looking at 1,176 entries, which is going to correspond to the desire for a geo mean of 30.7, all the way down to maybe even 20.9, if we do it that way. So let, let's see what happens if we do 20.9. Just for the hell of it. So if we put in the filter where we want a geo mean of less than 20.9, we can certainly get some. And as you'll see, I don't think you're going to get any um, straight up, you know, four threes with T1 and DK together. Um, you're getting some bro, some, you know, some some of everybody here. Let me just take a look at the, at the, uh, or Fred Brion, who's been playing here. Um, so Palu played on the on August eighth, and Effort hasn't played. So okay, so Palu is going to be in there, and I, I this is what kind of what I like. So let's um, do we need to even go more than Min Uniques one for this? Probably not, right? Go min uniques two. Let's let's do this right to, to make sure it's um yeah. So if we went to min uniques two, we would look like that. Min uniques three, 
No, it's 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 yelling at me now. So let's go back to Minion Unique's two, and we'll do that. So we're getting Nonsham, Bro, T One, and DK, and all four threes. But we don't need them all, right? We need. We already have fifteen of those four twos, so we only need twenty five. So we need twenty five of these. And that's what we're going to get. So what you're going to want to be rooting for, just so you guys know, is, is just all combinations that are not T DK T1 together. And we have we have a decent sampling of all the other possibilities. Um, the only thing I would say is that I don't know if I'm seeing enough Like the only supports we have are Caria and Palu. We're not we're not getting to Moham, which is uh which is a little scary. But you know what? It's like I don't know, maybe 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 we get lucky and, and they, they resub these guys out. Crap. I mean I, I even gave him Kellen's projection and we're still not getting to him. So I guess that just means that it's just not going to be in the cards today. So let's download these. And we'll include these. We'll include these four twos in the mix. And then we'll just paste these in. And that's going to be our 40 lineups in, in the shock blast. And I think these are pretty, you know, these are pretty different, you know? These are all pretty different. And, and are they likely to win? No. But I think that when they when they do win, they have a chance to to duplicate with very, very few players. So I think it's kind of worth uh, taking the shot. Oh, so it's only 36 entries we can play? All right, well, that's fine, too. So let's do whatever we can. And then let's go back and do the Triumphant Warrior. And for the Triumphant Warrior, we can just go ahead and just probably put in our favorite lineup, right? Well, this one looks kind of interesting. It's it's a little abnormal looking. So let's put this one in, actually. Putting owner at the captain like that. All right, so let's save that one. Um, no, I don't want to do that. So we could, we could actually, we're going to do this manually, actually. So, so we'll remember who we have. So it's owner and the captain with Gumayusi, Kerry, and C1, and then fill in the rest. So let's do, we can do that manually. It's fine. So you see all these are leaving money on the table here. We like that. So as I said, uh, owner and the captain. And then who else in T1 was it? It was, um, no, so it was Klingon, Lucid, Showmaker. Klingon, Lucid, Showmaker, and then the rest, T1, if I'm not mistaken. We you see carry a team one. Okay. Um, and so this is going to be our triumphant warrior. Hopefully this is not duped again. And we should be good to go. Um, with only 40 minutes to post. Good luck, everybody.